What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Delvin from Belize City, bringing to you yet another vampire deck profile. It's more than likely more like a zombie profile mixed with a little vampire engine splashed in it, but it's pretty amazing guys, pretty dope. Let's take a look at it. So starting off with the vampire deck, uh, we're going to start with the the profile of the monsters used. Now this deck consists of a 44 card uh, deck. We, for monsters, we're using one Orbital Hydrolander, two Doom King Baldurush, one Vampire Red Baron, one Vampire Scarlet, one Grimson, one Shadow, and one Fraley. Now, uh, for the other, in, well, for the additional cards that we're using, level fours and threes, we're I run, actually running two of the Banshee, we're running one Gozuki, one Mizuki, one Spirit Master, three Solitaires, and three Uni Zombies. Uh, we're also running Hand Traps, only two Ash Blossom, one Vampire. We're using one of the Vampire uh, Search Engines, which is the Vampire Retainer. And the other from Monsters, Vampire Retain actually searches the Vampire Spell and Trap cards. Uh, and we're using one Vampire Familiar who searches the Monsters. Two Glow Up Blooms. Alright, so let's get into the Spell and Trap card version, uh, variant of this deck. So we're using one, one for one, which special summons the level ones from the deck. As you can see, we're running three level ones in the deck. We're actually using Reasoning. Now this gives us a pretty good opportunity that we don't have to waste our normal summon uh, to get a monster. So if you join into Reasoning, we can just activate Reasoning, get it, uh, have your opponent guess from 1 to whatever number, alright? And upon 1 to 12, sorry. And if they don't guess it right, we excavate cards, get a free special summon, and we can start combos from there. Uh, we're running 1 Foolish Burial, 1 Monster Reborn, 2 Shinrei Yu sto uh, Story Saga, uh, Ghost Meets Girl, I'm sorry. Now, this is actually a pretty good card because it helps you dump cards from your hand to the graveyard. Also, the one for one helps you dump cards from your hand to the graveyard. Also, to fuel your graveyard with zombies so you can flood the field uh, this turn or the other turn, the next turn coming up. So, we also run uh, Pick Plays, two All Battle Graves. For those pesky hand traps, you don't want to get a hand trap while you're actually starting and trying to loop up your combos. And three zombie world for the lock. So uh, to, for interruptions, we're actually running Shinra use style swallow slash. Now uh, this card basically pops two cards. Okay, then uh, banish a Shinra you from the deck. Uh, to the send a Shinra you from the deck and banishes it. So you could pop that off with Shinra use. Uh, Spirit Master, Shinrei Spirit Master will then chain, uh, pop in another face up card on the field that your opponent controls. Alright, so if you have Spirit Master in the graveyard, you could then get Shinrei Solitaire's effect, which will then special summon uh, Shinrei Spirit Master from the remove from play to the field. Alright, uh, for addition, additional track cards, we're running one Vampire Awaken, Awake, uh, one Shinrei Style Summer Sarah. Samsara and two Rivalry of the Warlords and two Vampire Domination. Alright, so we're, we're actually using the Shinra Yu style Samsara to actually get combos popped up because we could uh, turn battle damage to zero by banishing one face up zombie type monster you control. You take no damage until the end of this turn, even if this card leaves the field. So that's a pretty dope effect. We also have the second effect that you can target two of your banished zombie, oh, I'm sorry, banished zombie type monsters with zero defense, shuffle them back into the deck, and draw one card. So it gives us plus and it replenishes the deck, guys. So that's a good, that's a great card to use within this deck. Uh, all right. So, for example, we already know that Bloat Bloom banishes itself, Vampire Retainer banishes itself. Uh, we'll be banishing Solitaire, uh, Spirit Master, and we have a lot of other banishes that we can do. Uh, Retainer, okay, so we could recycle these guys. We already know that Gozuki will banish a card to special summon another card from your hand. So you could banish anything that has zero defense or on the field to get the zero damage effect. Alright, so it's a pretty dope card. 
Now we have the negates in here, which is the, the vampire domination, which helps you gain life points if you negate a monster, or it could actually negate a spell or a trap card and stop your opponents in their trap. So going into the uh, extra deck, we're actually running one Link Karibo. Now we use this card once we get a hard uh, normal summon. We could normal summon fam familiar, uh, go into Link Karibo. Uh, once we have a vampire in hand, we could ditch that vampire, special summon back familiar. Familiar will search another vampire from the deck and add it to your hand back with the cost of 500. Now, once we do that, we could actually go into a, into a couple of broken plays because if we actually have Zombie World on the field, we could activate Zombie World, Normal Summon, Glow Bloom, uh, Send Glow Bloom, Special Summon Link Karibo, Glow Bloom Effect will chain, Special Summon and King, Doom King Balderush will send uh, Doom King Balderush and the Link Karibo to the graveyard to Special Summon Vampire Sucker. Alright, so as you can see, it has potential combos. You can have a, a one card combo and then off with a pretty strong board. I'll give you guys an example in the video that I'll show you at the end of this uh, tour. Now, we use one Link Karibo, one Cerberus, two Vampire Suckers, one Phoenix, one Shinra Yu Splendid Saga. We're also uh, using Skull Dread, one Skull Dread, one Borrelo Dragon, one Ash. Avermax, uh, we're using one Crimson Knight Vampire Bram, this guy is pretty dope also. Uh, we can make a good amount of different levels in this deck, so possibilities, we could bring him out. Alright, we're also using Vampire Sheridan. Now, with these vampires that we have in the deck, these three specifically, Vampire Red Baron, uh, Vampire Scarlet, Scar Scarlet Scourge, and Vampire Grimson. And Freeling, I'm sorry. Once either of these four attacks and destroys an opponent monster, they get to special summon that monster back to my side of the field or your side of the field if you're running this deck. And from there, in your main phase two, you could actually go into Vampire Sheridan. It doesn't, it, regardless what the level is, Vampire Sheridan will let you overlay with that monster. Pretty dope. Uh, we're also running Shinra Yu Spirit Saga. Another nice crazy card when this card comes out you could well it doesn't have a upon summon effect but you can trigger its effect to banish a zombie and the zombie type that you banish if it's zombie fire and synchro you get all three effect guys so if you banish a zombie you'll get just all zombie monsters gain 300 attack if it's a fire you destroy one spell or trap card on the field and if it's synchro you destroy one monster in the field now remember you could destroy this card uh Tribute use its effect, banish this card, and when you banish this card, all three effects will apply. Alright? And you could always bring this card back with Splendid Saga in your opponent's turn. Quick effect. Alright, then we use one red eyes zombie necro dragon, another dope crazy card. Uh Cyframe Lord Omega and Shinrayu Shogun Saga. Alright, so this is the uh, that guys, pretty much in a nutshell. Nice. I'll go ahead and give you guys the video. Let me know what you think. Go ahead, subscribe, smash that thumbs up button, and let me know. All right. So going into the replay for the vampire deck. Here we go. Okay, so this is one of the plays that I was explaining to you. Uh, with one card, you can pretty much do a lot, of, a lot of damage to your opponent. It's all about getting that control, guys. And that pretty much holds its own against uh, tier decks. For example, this is a rocket deck and it actually holds its own against a rocket deck, which everyone is now saying that it's going to be a, a tier deck, you know, a tier zero deck or something, but we'll see what's happening.
Alright guys, that's it. Um, that was one of the videos that I had. Now, again, go ahead, destroy that subscribe button, and hit your boy up. Let me know what you think. Leave comments below. Have a great day.